So, first thing we got to do is actually download Node.js. Once, once we download Node, then we're going to be able to start our React app. Uh, so yeah, go ahead, download it, and we're going to install it. Just go ahead, next, 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 next. And please wait while the setup wizard prepares to guide you. Migrating features. Okay. And go ahead and install. And let's go for it. Let's install. I don't, I usually don't click on that one. Uh, yeah. And that's it's pretty simple. It's pretty straightforward to install Node. So once you have successfully installed uh, Node, go ahead and finish it. So once you open up your Visual Studio code, you just go ahead and open your terminal. You check your Node version now. Uh, also your NPM. All right, cool. So we know now that uh, we have Node installed, which is good. So we're gonna go ahead and create our app. Let's just call it demo app. You can call it whatever you want. It seems like we're stalling it and that's good. Okay, so we have installed, we have created our React app. And so to actually see it online in our browser, we just say npm start. Okay. So first we gotta open up the 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 actual application. I opened a, a, a fresh new window and um yeah. this is what I was talking about. Since I'm so since I actually just created a random application, I'm inside uh row A and have all my stuff here. Okay, this is the demo app that I just created. I created in, a, in, a, in my general directory. So we're gonna go ahead and CD into demo app. But if I would have created another um, folder into a subfolder into a subfolder, that would have been that would have been fine too. But I just wanted to show you how you would actually do it. So right now I'm gonna launch the application. And it should open up um, localhost on my browser automatically. So cool. We're gonna get to see it load up. The one thing I like about npm and I don't like uh, what I like about it is that you can create custom scripts with with Node and your, your npm and all that stuff. And, and I think that's cool, but what I don't like is that sometimes it could get a little heavy, um, a lot of scripts, and it can get a little bloated. So, but, you know, everything's advancing, um, and I think we'll get to a point where it becomes a little better for MPM. But for now, uh, they're doing just fine. Okay, so right now we're actually inside the demo app right here, and we got a public folder, and we got an index. And obviously, you know, I'm not gonna need that, but source, app.js, you got your logo and everything. And it's JS. Yeah, so everything is here, guys. Everything is here.
I'm just gonna change the color a little bit. Just for just for messing around. And then it compiles successfully every single time you do, you do a correct change. I just change that. But yeah, this is it. This is your React app. And go ahead and start breaking it. <laughs>